This is your LMAX Exchange technical update for Friday, October 21st, 2016. Euro dollar. So the euro remains under pressure and the market is now considering the establishment below critical support in form of that June low, which came in at 109.12. If the market can establish a daily close below 109.12 over the coming sessions, it will open the door for an acceleration down towards the 105 area. At this point, any rallies are classified as corrective, ideally now seen supported by, seen capped by previous support turn resistance in the 110 to 112, 110 to 111 area, with only a break back above 1367 to really take the immediate pressure off the downside. Sterling dollar. So cable is trying to correct out from those 31 year lows that were seen down in the 120 area, but overall the pressure clearly remains on the downside here, and the market might not be done trading down to fresh lows. Any rallies are classified as corrective and should be well capped by previous support, now turn resistance in the 2790 area. Dollar yen. So dollar yen remains confined to a downtrend, but the market is showing signs of potentially wanting to uh, change that structure and push back to the top side. We would need to see the establishment back above recent resistance around 104.64 to confirm and accelerate gains. Inability to do that will keep the pressure on the downside with a break back below 102.80 to strengthen the bearish outlook and accelerate declines. Euro Swiss. So Euro Swiss continues to trade within its well-defined consolidation and the market has been very well capped towards 110 and very well supported on dips down towards 108 until we see a break on either end. Expect this range trade to continue. Aussie dollar. So Aussie has seen a sharp setback in recent trade. Once again, the market has stalled out up above 77, where it's been uh, seen formidable resistance over the past several months. At this point, look for the f reversal that we saw in Thursday trade to open the door for deeper setbacks back towards next key support, which comes in around 77.40, 74.40. Dollar CAD. So Dollar CAD remains constructive with the market continuing to be very well supported on dips and there's room for fresh upside beyond the recent highs that we saw up in the 33.13 area and for a move towards 135 to 140. At this point only back below 130 would compromise the constructive outlook. Kiwi dollar. So Kiwi is showing signs of topping out after this latest rally, so that latest corrective rally has stalled out above the recent resistance that we saw in the 72 area, unable to establish back above 73. This sets the stage for a resumption of declines and a potential lower top, and this will be confirmed on a break back below recent support, which came in around 70.35.